Let's throw some stuff out there as far as, you know, things that people think about that are required or that are important pieces of the mortgage world. Um, how about the first one? This is one of my favorites, actually, is that, and I hear it a lot, I am going to pay off my mortgage as quickly as possible. I don't want to have a mortgage on my house. Is that always necessarily true? No, absolutely not. There are um, people who think that mortgages, like any debt, is just plain evil. Yeah, that's right. Um, and I think this is more of an individual thing myself, but the, the concept that you should always pay off your mortgage as quickly as possible, it, in my opinion, is a myth because, uh, first of all, you have to look at each individual situation. Some people have significant debt that is right. not tax deductible, that has higher interest rates, higher payments, right. and they should absolutely put every extra available cent into paying off that debt before they would ever consider paying off their mortgage. Exactly, because credit card debt, let, even right. auto, auto debt, car, whatever anything. it is, not right. deductible, higher in cost, right? I mean, right. You're paying in, a higher in fact, you could rate. make the case that you, it, those are depreciating assets, significantly depreciating assets, right. by the way. And you should, if you would, if you had the ability to pay it in cash, that would be a much smarter thing than to finance well, it. Hey, but not everybody has that ability. So pay those off first before you would consider paying off your mortgage. And that's your opinion, and I share it, and it, it's important for everyone to understand it to hear that you know you can have a different opinion sure, I mean, there's absolutely. no right or wrong on this but, right you know my feeling is that you know first of all interest rates at three and three quarters and less than four percent i mean almost historically low very from still the beginning very good of historically time, right no doubt. Uh, secondly it's you know about a third of that is going to come back to you because uncle sam lets you deduct it on your taxes sure. so the cost of doing it after taxes it's just very, very low. And Cheapest money, as we say it many times, it is the least expensive form of, of money that you'll be able to borrow anywhere. And even if you just look at it from a from a performing asset perspective, you know, you've got no mortgage on your house, so you own it free and clear. It's not there's no leverage, it's not performing for you. I mean it's Well, there are ways to access that equity if you were in that but situation. But that's called a mortgage. Well, that's true, but Anyway, so, so that's number one. Number one. So uh, make your the point about that though is that don't buy into the myth. You know, yeah. don't listen to everybody's situation is different. Right. We and, can have a conversation about that if any of the listeners are interested in doing that. Exactly. Yeah.